Okay, I'm just gonna share with you my weekly healthy grocery haul. I picked up first thing some pepper and onion blend. And I see some of the other uh, creators doing mukbangs and some of them will eat uh, these mini cucumbers. So I said, I've got to try them. I have a can of lentil soup. Sometimes I will add it into other types of, um, you know, I'll make a concoction with some vegetables or sometimes I'll eat it plain just like that. Then I have a jar of green olives. Got some bananas, two things of bananas. Then this large watermelon. Had to get some more of that because we go through watermelon like I don't know what. And I'm the one that eats the majority of it because I'm always eating fruit practically every single day. And next, green teas in the house. This tea is good, you guys. I don't know if you've ever heard of it, if you've ever tasted it, but it's pretty good. Green tea with, um, let me see if I can get this to focus. Green tea with ginseng and honey. And it tastes really good. So I have four of those. Got some Greek pita bread. This is the whole wheat. First time trying this, so I want to see what that's like. Then we got some yams. I have four of those. Did I show you guys the olive, I mean, not the olive oil, the avocado oil? Yes. A bottle of avocado oil. There's two mangles right here. Two packages of romaine lettuce. And then we pack, picked up this um, little pack of carrots, celery, and snap peas. That should be interesting. Everybody's been eating these on their mukbang videos and I said, I have got to get me some. So got me some sweet peppers, got some uh, avocados, some tomatoes, uh, bell peppers, green bell peppers, and then a bag of um, uh, cucumbers. Anyway, I got some broccoli slaw, which is organic. I've got some more lettuce, the uh, romaine hearts, picked up a pack of that, and We've got some spinach, it's organic spinach and spring mix. And this is a big tub here, so mm, I love this lettuce, it's so good. And Then we have some tortilla strips that go in the salad. Croutons, got two packs of those. I have some unsalted sunflower seeds because I love those. Got some tilapia fillets, which is fish. I've got some celery here, big long thing of celery. And I bought a lot of beans because I'm gonna be packing it up with the beans. <laughs> I got some red beans, two packs of those. I thought I would try a black bean. I normally get the one from the can, you know, cause I don't usually eat black beans that often, but I'm starting to incorporate them in my, you know, in my meal. So I'll go ahead and make that. So I just got one pack of that. Some black eyed peas, haven't had these in so long. Mm, these are so good. And I picked up some chickpeas, which is garbanzos. Got a big thing of pinto beans, cause you know, I tell you with the way I eat nowadays, I go do a lot of these beans. Cause this is basically what I eat for my main protein. Then I have some medium black olives, cause I can't stand those big jumbo ones. You know, the ones they have, and fortunately they had the the smaller one so i'm so happy then every now and then i'm going to be having me some whole wheat pasta and this is the penne penny or whatever you want to call it penny penne got some low sodium um, almonds with sea salt two boxes of uncle ben's brown rice the one that you boil in the bag because i don't have time to be 
dealing with all that slaving in the kitchen. <laughs> Oregano leaves, seasoning, spices, or whatever you want to call it. Some Italian seasoning. I have a table blend of Mrs. Dash. Mrs. Dash, I love her. Seasonings are good. And some more garlic powder, because we definitely ran out. And I'm telling you, I use garlic powder pretty much on everything that I cook. Time some Skinny Girl uh, dressing, balsamic vinegar. And it says fat-free, sugar-free dressing for my salad. And I finally picked up some Skinny Girl popcorn. Now, I wanted to try this. I normally don't eat popcorn but once in a blue moon. But I said, you know what? That once in a blue moon, I'm gonna have this one. And this is the lime and salt. So I really hope there's not a lot of salt in it. And it's 25 calories per cup popped. There's 10 bags in here. So and some more seasoning. I put this on my salad. This is the Mrs. Dash Southwest Chipotle. So I think that's probably spicy. I don't know. Then I had to pick up some more thyme, ground thyme, because I miss having it. And last but not least, I picked up some some more uh, lightly salted rice cakes. But to me, they're delicious. You have to acquire a taste for these type of things, and it's 100% whole grains, gluten free, and um, hey, it's a delicious snack. Shoot, sometimes when I want popcorn and I don't want to eat regular popcorn, I will take about two or three of these and break it up into very small pieces and put it in a bowl and kind of have the illusion that I'm eating popcorn, so. Okay, I just want to share my dinner that I'm having tonight. And that concludes this video, you guys. I will see you next week for the final week of the Clean Eating Challenge. Thank you so much for watching. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.